Hi guys, okay today I want to be talking about batteries and the ones I've been using on my UPS's um, obviously there's there's quite a few different types um, in my opinion these ones that I'm using are the best for my requirements so what we have here is a Deltic and it's a high cycle and it is a 105 AH amps per hour um, so the only difference really between these two is that the poles are different as you can see they are screwing and these are more the traditional ones that um, we used to um, I personally prefer these because it's much easier to to do the necessary connections you also have this guy here which is a um, a smaller type of one um, it's all 12 volt and of course this one is a 6.8 ah or amp per hour um, these are more popular for like your alarms and stuff but you can also use this for your ups but obviously with this amount of battery power you're not going to have much uh, po power or use for the UPS so you're very limited all right so I also want to touch a bit on serial connection and parallel connection um, it's quite important because your different UPSs obviously require different ways of connection so I want to do that as well so at least then you're given an idea what it's all about all right so what I've done now is I have done a serial connection as you can see the negative to the positive and that leaves us then with the positive and negative out now as I said before these are 12 volts but with this scenario where you connect the positive and the negative pole you now will have a 24 volt on the battery so if you take your meter and you put it onto so volts DC and you should now on the opposite poles you should be able to get a reading of 24 volts <clears throat> so we take a positive and ne negative lead put it on the negative then the positive and as you can see you get more or less 26.39 which is which is fair because these batteries is more likely over 12 volts so that is correct so you so basically the what we have is a serial connection and your capacity of your battery has now changed from 12 volts to 24 volts all right so as we can see now what I've done now is basically connect the positive to the positive the negative to the negative and what this now will give you is basically a 12 volt voltage um, because this is a parallel connection um, please ignore the the red the red and black this is just for demonstration purposes um, obviously one thing that you gotta be very very careful with is also that you gotta be very careful with when you do these connections um, I would recommend that in any other serial or parallel that the the poles that's now gonna go out to the to the UPS should be protected as well and I recommend something like this um, it's a 20 amp where you basically then have the option to either switch off or well, switch on or switch off and that just protects the batteries as well I'll, yeah. so let's now look at this as I said this is a parallel connection so if I put my fluke meter on again to to voltage DC I should now by this looking at the 
two poles here I should then have a reading of 12 volts positive and negative gives me around about 13.34 which is which is fine um, I am quite happy with that all right so basically that's the the difference between parallel and serial connection and as I said please be very careful when you connect these on make sure they are secure and use make use of the be careful at all times thank you for watching